Hello. Gabrielle's on FaceTime. I just got to Target and I want to go inside to see if I can find a pajama set, but I'm highly, I highly doubt that I'll find one because a lot of people have been getting their pajamas, but I know that I need pajamas for Kiana's birthday party in two weeks or so. So we're going to go see if they have a matching set in my size and browse around for some other essentials. <laughs> And we're walking. But he won't work. I was just leaving Target and I see there's a store called Bargain Hunt and I kinda wanna go in there to see like what they got going on for the low. Bargain hunt. Thank you. Little lady. Welcome to Bargain Hunt. <laughs> Please. <laughs> like, how do I know how much this is? It doesn't even have a tag. For a tree skirt, this ain't no bargain. $20? They lying. If they lying, they lying. They lying. They got the same brand as Target. I don't see the bargain in here. Oh. It's not hunting for it. This is $30. Where's the bargain? <laughs> I know you want to say something so bad, Gabrielle. And they're laughing at you. They said she thought she was going to find her party. I'm dead. Let's see. $7 for a towel. $24. That's cute. $3 bowl. Let's Just left out of Bargain Hunt. I guess it's a cool store, but I didn't really feel like anything was a bargain except for the tissue. So, I ended up getting some tissue. It was like $8.55 compared to $10. And it's the Angel Soft brand. Okay, y'all, my last stop is Home Goods and TJ Maxx. see if we can find something home goods and tj maxx was a fit i didn't really see anything that caught my attention or anything that i needed right here right now so maybe next week when they get a new shipment in i want a coffee table and maybe some side tables for the couch and i thought they would have um some nice items but they didn't so now i'm about to head home and relax good morning y'all it's a new day i'm about to get my hair done it's currently pressed out and i'm getting another press because i'm getting braids on december 26th and i just can't last that long i got this done on november 16th 
and my hair is extremely itchy like I'm just ready for a nice wash and a fresh silk press so I will show you guys my hair once I am done I made it home and my hair is done I never do body I usually do bone straight but I'm not mad at it I think it looks really good it only took her let's see we started at 10 a.m. and I was out the chair by 11:30, and I'm just so happy to have a clean scalp again because it was getting itchy. She's really fast. I'll have her info down below if you guys are interested. I'm getting ready to eat some lunch. I'm gonna eat this Caesar salad for lunch. I think it'll be good. I need to eat it before it goes bad because it's been in there for a little while. Probably about like five days. Still looks fresh though. If we're being 100% honest, I would rather be eating some pizza right now, but whatever. Like, why do we have to eat healthy to be in shape? I got this salad from Walmart. I think they have different kinds. This is the Caesar salad. Let's see. I'm gonna put my dressing down first. Mmm. This is baking pretty good. Last night I made bacon cheeseburgers. But I just know five guys would have been so much better. Is this even enough? I guess um, I need every single drop from out of here. Yeah, I'm so tired. Bone appetit. Let me mix it since Oh my gosh, I should have knew that was gonna happen. This salad still look dry. I'm about to put some ranch in here. I have a Christmas tree. Originally, I was gonna get a four foot Christmas tree from Pop Shelf because they had them there for $5. Wouldn't have taken up too much space, would've been cute, something nice, easy to set up, easy to take down. However, my parents have two Christmas trees, so they allowed me to take one of the Christmas trees, a six foot. It's the same thing from last year, honestly. If you guys go back and check out my Vlogmas videos, you guys will see me put up the tree. I got it from Target, and I have it in here. Um, I think it's cute. Honestly, if I wasn't being lazy, I would fill it up some more because there's a lot of empty spaces, but I mean, I feel like it gets the job done, and I think it looks cute in here. Unfortunately, I don't have any vlog footage of me setting it up, but here it is. If you guys want to see me set up the Christmas tree, check out last year's Vlogmas. The lighting sucks. I got off work not too long ago. I'm getting ready to go to the grocery store because I want to make shrimp alfredo tonight. But I kind of want it to taste like Olive Garden's pasta sauce. I went on TikTok and looked up a Olive Garden pasta sauce copycat recipe. So I need to go to the grocery store to get the ingredients so I can make dinner tonight. And I want some garlic bread. Here is everything that I got. I'm turning into a great value queen, okay? Got some garlic bread sticks, cookie dough, need some butter. The Olive Garden recipe calls for this these items right here. The only thing that I'm missing is parsley. Walmart did not have any, so it's like I'm doing what I can. 
And I've been having a sweet tooth lately, so cookie dough it is. All right, y'all, Stephanie's here. Last night I made shrimp alfredo. Stephanie, all the years we've known each other, she has never tried any of my cooking. At all, y'all. Let me turn down the TV. I gotta turn it down for this. Yeah, Walmart didn't have any parsley flakes, so it looks a little. It looks good. Uncolored. But I give the presentation. It smells good. It smells really good. Uh oh. Ooh. This bread smells like Olive Garden bread. No, hold on now. Uh, <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me find me some like utensils are in that one. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. I'm nervous. Stephanie's never ate any of my food. Mm. Don't get a Let me get a shrimp. <laughs> Let me see how the seasoning is, okay? Mm. Uh oh. Hold on, let me let it marinate. <coughs> hmm. That's good. Oh, <laughs> it's oh good. So shoot. <laughs> <laughs> is it good for real? No, that's good. Let me find out. That is good. It's good for real. Yeah, let me taste this bread. Okay. This now that's that's frozen food. It's good too. That's good. That's good. Mm-hmm. Or is it good? Or are you just hungry? Both. Okay. I'm just joking. Oh. No, I'm hungry. Oh, no, see. no, no, no. This is good. All right. It's good. I'm glad you like it. Sorry. Stephanie and I are back at IKEA. <laughs> what is that, Steph? My bag. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Yep. Aw, it's foggy. Last time I was here, I got a cutting board. Don't know if I'm gonna get anything today, but if I do, I will show you guys. I'm just here for the vibes. And today I'm, all, I'm buying all my kitchen stuff. She's buying all her kitchen stuff. Or the rest of it. Or the rest of it. <laughs> So, yes. It's so nasty out here. I know, the rain. I left my rain boots at my parents' house, so I got my Uggs on. But thankfully, it's not, like, pouring at the moment. Mm -mm. What you mean? Uh-uh. Get somebody else to do it. What? <laughs> that is how it goes. <laughs> oh, look, they have those spoon-to-use games. You need something to put it in. Yeah. There's a black one right there. Are those black ones? No. I guess that's just oh, the lid. Oh, those are. Okay. Let me think of stuff that I would need. What is useful for the kitchen? Um. <laughs> stuff that, like, I can't. Did you ask your roommate what she has already? Oh, I saw a little bit of what she has. Okay. Well, it's good that you guys do have your, you know, separate things. Yeah. Like this is something you right? Mm, it's similar, but it doesn't have enough. I like the rubber thing. So like, you said you got plates. it from where? I got mine from Ross. I guess I'll just go to Like that one? That's too big though. Do they have smaller ones? Do you like this one? Are you kind of like the one I have? I like the one you have. Yeah, that's at Ross. Yeah. If y'all are looking for a cheap set of like Tupperware, this is a set of 17 for only $7.99. I think that's a pretty good deal. If you ask me. How much what is? The wood one? Yeah. That's noise. Let me look in the little app. I like this one, Steph. If I saw this, I would have got I it. I know, I'm just not seeing it. Scan items in the store, I guess. Let me know how much it is. I want to look at these pans. Because I feel like I need another frying pan. How much are they? $30. How much is it, Steph? Oh, that's not bad. Mm-mm. Oh, shoot. <gasps> My boot. Them dirty wheels. 
Yeah. I've had these for a year. Okay, let me come up to this kind of board. That's a baking tray. They're so cheap. Oh, I hate that noise. Oh, <laughs> I cannot stand that. Noise. My bad. <laughs> I don't think that's a baking tray. It has to be. D um. It just says. Tray. It can't be something that goes in the oven. It it's plastic. That's why they got these things over here, right? That's plastic stuff. Okay, I'm not gonna. That's like a tray you present something on, I feel like. Am I tripping? Okay, I won't get it. So I'm in the bathroom section looking for like a stand for my products that are on the counter. I'm gonna see if I can find something. And I'm seeing these things for the shower. But not for ten dollars. Who lied and said Ikea had the deals? But that's not what I'm looking for. They were saying like people getting UTIs off of the pink toilet paper. It's weird. this little baby cart <laughs> after we said we wasn't getting too much had to do it I know. Yeah, Steph gave my stuff uh oh she broke it what did you do <laughs> mm. you so funny that's my team the doormat oh you oh, did too I can get a toy my bad I can't afford it I have officially made it back home. Y'all probably already saw what I got, but just to get a close up of what I got from Ikea. We also went to Ross and then the beauty supply store. I don't have footage from those two stores, but here's what I got from Ikea. So I have uh, two of these fake plants and I'm gonna put these plants over there on the TV stand. Got a, I also got a microwave cover so food can stop splattering around in the microwave and I don't have to struggle to clean it out. And I also got a outdoor mat so I can have something to wipe my feet on when I walk into the apartment. This was actually a good price. Honestly, wanted something with like a cute little quote or a funny quote or something, but honestly, this will do. Sunshine reminds me of positive vibes and that's what I'm trying to bring when people come into my apartment. All right. So I'm gonna come over here, just turn the light on. Like right here. Isn't that cute? And then another one on that side. Let's see what it looks like from afar. My TV is a little off center on the TV stand. However, I think it looks good and simple. Very minimalistic. Y'all look at my Christmas tree. Let me turn these lights off. Woo! I am out of breath. And then I'm gonna have to wash this. Oh, come on. Don't judge me, my microwave's a little dirty, but here is what it will look like once I wash it. You know what I don't like? It doesn't have like holes at the top to pick it up, but it has like this little ridge on the side. So I'll be like, 
<sighs> but yeah, gotta wash that. And then by the door. My hair still smells so good. Did I get my hair done yesterday? I have bad memory. Yes, I got my hair done yesterday. Oh my gosh, it looked so much better yesterday with the curls. This is too high. Um, I don't be putting heat on my hair after I get it done. Even though it's poofy. It's not poofy, but it's poofy. Like, obviously, there's like, you know, some frizz going on. But it's still not oily. It's still flowy. Like it's clean so i don't really put heat on my hair but i saw this tiktok trend where people wrap their silk presses in um stocking caps and i've been doing that and i actually like the way my hair looks in the morning so if you're new to this and not true to this i'm going to show you guys how it's done I would recommend getting a different stocking cap. Mine does the trick, but I mean, I feel like there's some other stocking caps that would be more comfortable for my head because the waistband on this stocking cap is kind of thick and kind of hurts my head. Like it's not painful or anything, but I know it could be more comfortable. But anyway, I'm gonna put this on such as like, well, and you gotta be careful because you don't want your hair tugging at night. Put it on. It's like every time I try to make it perfect, I mess it up. It doesn't have to be perfect. Well, I don't care if it's perfect or not. I'm not a Virgo. 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 Because I'm a Virgo. If you're a Virgo, are you like that? Like sorry my brother's a virgo but i don't know virgos and their energy like everything has to be perfect and no problem with that but it's like because i'm a virgo it's always because i'm a virgo sit your virgo behind down somewhere i'm a pisces pisces in the chat stand up and if you're a Virgo, you have to subscribe to this video because I said so and you're a Virgo and you just have to do it since y'all got to do everything. That shade to the Virgos, all the Virgos. All right. So, yeah, I haven't really explained what I'm doing, but just split your hair into two. And then each part will go into a stocking cap leg or a pantyhose leg. Yeah, these are definitely stockings. Get pantyhose. They are way more comfortable. And then you just wrap it around. Ooh. Wrap it around your head. That's it. And I am G to G to get in a shower and relax. So here's what I look like. Here's the back. And then here's the front. And then I just pop my bonnet on top. Good night. I'll see you guys in the morning. I can't see the syrup that I dropped, but good morning, everybody. It's a new day, obviously. And here's my hair in the morning. Still fresh and still flowy. And that's that on that. Still fresh, still flowy. 
My hair is so thick, y'all. Other than my hair, I am so sick of my skin. I keep saying this, but... Mm. Truly, I've had enough. And... I'm just over it. I'm so ready for my dermatologist appointment because oh, I still didn't even go to CVS. I don't know if I told you guys that, but I need to go to CVS and ask them what's going on with my clindamycin and benzoyl peroxide, my morning topical, because where is it? Hopefully today is a good day. During lunch, I'm going to see Stephanie again. I'm with this girl as much as I can. I don't know if she has it put out on her YouTube channel yet, but y'all go subscribe to her. She is... She'll be leaving in January, so I'm trying to spend as much time with her as possible. I'm very excited for her, her new journey, um, going back to school. Like, this is a big dream of hers, and I'm going to miss her. She's going to be like almost 350 miles away from me. I'm going to miss her a lot. So, yeah. Um, this is why she's been... Um, this is why she's been going shopping for apartment and I've honestly just been tagging along for the vibes. If I see something from my apartment, just like I did yesterday when we was at Ikea, um, then I'll pick it up and grab it. If not, then I'm just there accompanying her while she shops around. <sighs> Today is going to be a good day. I'm claiming it in the name of Jesus. You can wash that out, right? Does this thing come off or no? Um, yeah, it does. Just wipe this off. Yeah, so you can rinse this off if you need. Cool. Has no price on it. Y'all, look at this vase and home goods. Take a guess right now how much you think it is. I'll give you a second. <laughs> Thirty-two dollars. That doesn't make any sense. I do. What does it say on the side? It better not say doctor. Oh, who is this? Doctor Ring. Oh no. You don't want to know who it be. Messed it up for me. I need a charcuterie board for Kiana's party. This is cute, but it has something on it. Like something with handles was perfect. Would be. In the car on the way to the next location, I was able to get some gifts, some Christmas gifts. I knocked two people off of my list, and I don't know, everybody else might just be getting gift cards, but <laughs> we'll figure it out once we get there. Y'all, we are at the mall, so Stephanie and I, well, I'm about to try boba for the first time. For the very first time, whatever. She's gonna get a surprise, y'all. Boba tea, boba, boba is good. Boba milk. That's what the girls, <laughs> that's what the girls are doing these days. Ryan's trying boba for the first time, y'all. Mm. Got it. What it you just think? <laughs> it tastes good. Oh my. Okay. Y'all, here's the one. Stephanie got good, strawberry good. smoothie with mango boba. <laughs> I'm going to a color party tonight and I'm getting ready to set my basket up. Here's basically what I have. I mean, my color is pink, obviously. Y'all know my favorite color is pink. So I went to Dollar Tree. I got this basket from Dollar Tree that was $3. There's wrapping paper, $1.25. Popcorn, $1.25. Why? Y'all see that? Everything above my thumb is air. Do better. I got some cookies from Walmart. Some candy that I was trying not to eat while I was watching movies just now. I actually just started Euphoria. I got two bottles of 
Lemon berry squeeze, the Hawaiian punch. I guess people can use it as chasers or just juice in general. And then I got a bottle of wine. Now I'm about to film a TikTok. I have everything set up. If you guys aren't following me on TikTok, make sure you guys do that and get my basket together to make it look cute. Everybody, we are at Kiana's place setting up. There goes Lemon, you guys' favorite lemon. There goes Kiana, and I met someone named Alexis. Hi. She has a YouTube channel too. What's your channel? Alexis K. Chester. Y'all, it's Alexis Chester. I'm, 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 I'm playing on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here's what we have so far I brought in a s'more board. We have subs, wings, pop. That's the best popcorn ever. Kiana, that popcorn? Yeah, do you want I was just telling Lexus. Have you had it? Yeah, I had to fix it for Asian It's wedding. so good. Do you want a bag? Yeah, I have Because I have like three. I was just yeah, telling Lexus that I actually got a chance to try it. Yes. It's so good. Have you tried that one? No, but I love popcorn. And this pizza? Better than, I mean, the movie theater needs to buy it. I love that popcorn. No, I do be popping my own. This is so cute. Like, you know, you buy the loose kernels and just put them on the stove. I slammed on brakes and it slid all around, so I had to put it back together myself. Wow. The cake? Yeah, this is in the shape of a 27. <laughs> so. Oh, gee. Whatever. Hey, you was laughing at me about my damn pizza. <laughs> we gotta Yes, you can. <laughs> Once again, with our special guest. <laughs> yes. We need a Jante um, feature. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> I ain't seen y'all in a minute mm. since her birthday. Y'all ain't seen her in a long time. How y'all doing? I hope, how you mama them? 